Bud, this whole dragon quest has gotten pretty freaking heavy. I just skipped right by him. I'm like, oh, I can't do anything. But then... The great worm is nothing but bone and memories. Where is it? Right here. Let's do this. Here we go. Here we go. The dragon spirit floods your mind and memory in a great torrent of power. He is with you. He is within you. He is you. The next words that spill from your mouth are not yours, but the worms. I am Ansor, heart of the gate, butchered in flesh, risen in spirit. Search mind for what possesses it, is what I did. wends his way through your mind like an unstoppable river. Your body is unmoving, yet thought flows effortlessly between you. The spirit pauses, and you feel the astral prism stir. Ansel senses the Emperor's presence within it. Answer me, Facey. Why have you come? So I do believe this quest is for lore because they're starting to discuss something that I heard something about. I mean, you know, harm. Let me go. Resonates within you. The torrent stills, only disturbed by the dragon's next words. Brack, my words aren't meant for you. They're meant for him. The emperor stirs in the astral prison. And in you, calm, curious, and detached. Old man, your presence has stirred me as it ever did. I am awakened. Oh boy. Answer. It's been too long. Alderan? No. I don't believe it. He called you Baldurin? I once answered to. Oh boy. A name I did not expect to hear again. Least of all from the mouth of an old friend. So. Friend. Mm. Yes. And more. Until you killed me. Have you come to dance on my bones, Baldurin? Was slaying me not satisfaction enough? This is heavy. Satisfaction? No. You left me no choice. You had every choice. You were becoming illithid. I offered you merciful death. You chose to fight. And now you bring your thrall before me. How far has the great Balderan fallen? Answer the question, Mind Flare. You owe it to both of us. Stillness. Ansur's consciousness hovers just above yours, searching, seeing. Dear Ansur. Enough! I gave you everything, Bordoran. And you repaid me in slaughter. It is time I return the favor. Oh boy. Let my bones rise and the storms gather. Witness Baldoran. The final tempest has come. I am the heart of the gate. I am the one who roars. This time, you will not escape it. Okay, so we have a pretty badass fight, apparently. Which I guess we could start with Boo. Who missed? Go figure. And if he moves, there's an attack of opportunity. For goodness. Okay, so the first swing. I won't give in. Um I guess. 
23. Does he have a dis... He doesn't have a weapon, does he? Target must have a weapon in hand. Menacing attack. Woo! Woo! Soul breaker. Invalid target. No soul. Miss. Pommel strike. Save from pommel strike. Okay. Action surge. Celestial haste. Gains hastened. Bolt celestial light. What happens if I use that? 14. I don't even know what that means. Oh. I'm like right underneath of him. Oh, geez. Who's this guy? A water myrm derm derm A water myrm derm 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 A water myrm derm derm Okay, we might... Who's up for bat here? Who's up at bat? Okay, we're we're frenzying what's we're frenzying friends person. Reckless attack. Where's frenzied strike? Cleave. Avernus branding smite. Uh lacerate. Reckless attack. 66. Another water manirm derm 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 Oh! Time's running out. Is it? Asterion. Does he see you coming? Bolderan. What have you done? I've assembled a team. An elite team. Okay, what the hell is this now? Why isn't the fight over? You mean to tell me we still have to fight these water bitches? What happens if I lightning strike a water bitch? Frick all, not much. Alright, Lizelle. No, Lizelle. Go do... Go do a melee attack, Lizelle. This is your end. There we go. Now get out of the way. This is some. Oh, this is what's her face? That sucked. Water manundern. Oh! I just knocked his ass off the edge. So where's the other aggro? Huh? Where's, where, where's the other aggro? Oh, he's right there. Okay. I think I could go another round. Okay, we'll go another round with, um... Wait, if that's water... And we hit it with ice... Like, water has to have... Wait, who are we here? I'm losing track of my characters. Oh, this guy. Okay, well, you know what? Um, I just hit him with a level 2 hail of thorns. Ouch! I probably shouldn't have done that. No choice but to keep going. Well, I'll slash on this guy. Slash on him again. Slash on him again again. Who's next? I'm sore. I never thought I'd see him again. So is it true? You're Baldurin? 
I was. Now, I am much, much more. You're a bit of a but problem. It seems you are more interested in my past. Yeah, bud. Frickin' spit it out. I just need... <laughs> you literally... Of course I'm interested. Such sentimentality. Very well. Spit it out, bud. It's like I always told you. I was just like you. An adventurer who yearned for greatness. And in mortal terms, I achieved it. As captain of the wandering army, Here we go. I acquired enough gold to found Baldur's Gate. I stayed for a while to watch my city grow. But it was not enough. I grew restless again. The sea called to me. And I ran to her with open arms. It's a big freaking city. Life at sea was not easy. Our last adventure was ruinous. My ship was destroyed. My crew lost. But my spirit was far from broken. I was determined to return in triumph once again. I heard of treasure in Moonrise. I strove to find it. What I found was an illithid colony, where I acquired a tadpole much like yours, and became a mind flayer, enthralled to the Elder Brain. It was Ansor who found me. Ansor who pulled me from the Brain's domination. Ansor who brought me home. He sought to cure me of my sickness. Oh, wow. Called on every healer he could find. Nearly broke his spirit in the attempt. But he failed to understand. I wanted no healing. I was not sick. Do your allies always die? So you killed him? Even after he had exhausted all possibility of reversing my condition, he still clung to hope. I tried to convince him of my reality. I was on the cusp of greatness beyond my wildest dreams. But all he could see was a mind flayer. He came to me as I slept. A mercy killing in his mind. Oh. I saw the tears. I felt his grief. I had no choice but to kill him first. It was an act of self-preservation. Fair enough, I guess. I admire your commitment to survival, but your methods are questionable. There were no alternatives. In my place, you would have done the same. Do not think that I am ignorant of what I have lost. I may not regret my actions, but I do regret that they were necessary. While the past is beyond my influence, the present is not. It is time we move on. One nether stone remains. We must find it before the brain breaks free. <sighs> and you want to know something? Can't give up now. How is it the hell that this dragon so freaking badass it could raise from the dead in spirit, but I could physically kill it with swords? Like it's just. It's bones. It's, how do you kill spirit? Well, you kill all sorts of spirits here. It's just and Sur is dead. Game logic. There will be no great tempest roaring through the skies. No dragon redeemer to save us. What hope then for Baldur's Gate? Without the great worm's aid, is the city doomed to fall? You braved the worm's lair, seeking a savior. Yet it was you. All of you who vanquished the undead abomination which Ansur became. There you go. You are more powerful than you understand. No, I know how it powerful I am. It is you who are the tempest. It is you who are the heart of the gate. You're right. We are the warriors who'll slay the absolute. We are the guardians who'll defend this fair city.
It would have been nice to have a dragon along our side. Perhaps. But we will still smite the brain and still be hailed as champions. I could even claim my father's own ducal title and carry his banner after this. Grand Duke Will Ravenguard, Marshal of the Flaming Fist, the city's truest defender. You might find it an uphill battle to get the city populace to accept a devil as their duke. The Absolute's end would be the guarantee. Devilish visage be damned. If I were to call myself Grand Duke, no Patriarch would deny the claim. Yeah, that's a questionable one. He seems like he seems a little bit inflated all of a sudden. Uh, think of the power you'll yield. Imagine the good you could do. It's always been your destiny. I fear you. But the better are you. You're a hero, not a politician. Well, follow your heart, Will. I fought to right the wrongs of the coast, to slay the monsters that hunt the helpless. What good is a champion who puts himself above the people? What good am I as a politician just out of reach? There will be no Grand Duke Will Ravenguard, and there will be no Blade of Frontiers. I am now the Blade of Avernus. For as long as demons and devils imperil the Sword Coast, they will be my prey. Nod silently. The calm settles over you. The Elder Brain is a menace, but with the blade of Avernus at your side, you know you will triumph. That's kind of like a weird thing. He wants to talk more? The blade of Avernus. A new name for a changed man. The four pillars finally rise within me. Courage, insight, strategy, justice. I'm not to abide them, but to become them. Yeah, but enough reflection for today. Oh, frig, the audio is all over the celebrate. place in this game. A hearty meal would do the trick. A few hunks of fresh venison, a round of brown ale. What do you say? Well, let's not get ahead of, of course, ourselves. But we need nourishment, don't we? And we can't go beating up brains on empty stomachs. He seems you different all of a sudden. I'll scrounge up the ale. Prepare your belly for a roast a la blade. What are your plans once the blade is defeated? I scout both the hells and the coast's havens. And I destroy every fiend that dares put its eye on Faerun. Perception failed. Something's going on here. I failed. What? The heart of the gate is dead. We need to see my father. He should know what happened with Ansel. What is this freaking mood swings going on here, bud? Holy frick, bud. Okay, where's Loot and the Dragon here? Because apparently, yes. Oh boy. Oh boy, look at all this. Dear Anza, I've said it a thousand times and I'll say it again. There is no cure. That's all right. I'm fine. More than fine. I'm better than I've ever been. So why torture yourself with this? Of course I know why. Remember Yatangri? You and I sailed together for months seeking a great spire. By the time we found it, we were sick as dogs. But you never left my side, not for a moment. Even though you could have simply chosen to fly, you told me there was something about experiencing it with me through my eyes. You wanted to share my passion for adventure. It was, you said, a privilege. The truth is, a privilege was mine. You were the greatest thing that ever happened to me, Answer. I never asked... I never had to ask you for anything, but I'm asking you now to stop. I may no longer feel my feelings, but I know yours and yours are agony. It doesn't have to be this way. Be free, answer, fly. And know that even if I'm not beside you, I will always be your Baldurin. Your Baldurin. That's kind of weird. It almost sounds like... um. These two are uh, maybe a bit closer than just friends. You're Baldrin. Oh, the helm 
of Baldoran. The worm's tempest and his roar hurtle through you. Ansur's essence still lives within the helm, instilling you with power for as long as you wear it. Okay. We didn't we didn't get that little cutscene before. So let's 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 go put that back into and we got a sword now. Baldurin's giant slayer. Oh boy. Finally, something bigger and badder than the soul breaker. Oh, and it's it's gnarly. It has bumpy bits all over it. Okay, let's put the hat on now. We are the legendary warrior. Ugh. Well, it's it's suggesting to us that we should. Oh, we can't go to camp from here. We got to get the hell out of this place. So apparently, back at camp here, Will wants to talk to his dad. In theory. Or is that something we have to do? To camp. Father should know of Ansu's fate. We are at camp. The Absolute's voice is gone, but I still hear its echoes. Reflections. Are you telling me we need to do a long sleep? Oh, tell him about your battle. Counselor Forlick was relieved to hear that you were all right. While well, the Absolute commanded my mind, I condemned her to death and confined her in Worm's Rock Prison. She stood by me even as the Hell's fires lapped at my feet. You must free her. We did. We did. She's gathering allies as we speak. News. She proves as loyal to you as she is to me. Mm -hmm. I couldn't bear it if she died by my command. May the triad guide her steps. How did the cultists? I was returning from Elturel. My traveling party stopped at an inn, Joaquin's Rest. Sounds to familiar. Lay our heads. It wasn't the heat that woke me, it was the scent. Cultists had set fire to oh, the place. Oh, yeah, we were there. Yeah, 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 I yeah. Okay. Being taken. I remember that place now. Just the smoke burning my throat. Before I fell, I awoke in Moonrise Towers, inside one of those damnable pods. The rest, well, the rest goes without saying. Mm-hmm. I failed, Father. The worm is fallen. A terrible fate for Ansar, my son. Yet my hopes for the city's future have never been higher. I don't understand. You and your allies slayed the undead terror that was once the great answer. You were stronger than even the great worm. Hell yeah, you will brother. You want to part the storms and lead the people through. You, not answer, are the savior we need. First, you will fell the absolute. Then we will rebuild Baldur's Gate. We will take back our city together. I will name you Baldur's Gate's newest Grand Duke of the Council. You will be hailed Heart of the Gate. Grand Duke? I look the part of a fiend. I will tell the citizens and the patriarchs of your good works. They will know you carry your father's banner. Uncertainty fills the air. Will has reached a fork in his path. In which direction will he travel? You're a hero, not a rescrap. The blade is a champion. Duke Will Regan is not. Here we go. So we already had this conversation down in the pits. Hey, is this what they were saying? The one reviewer was like, oh yeah, act one is like perfect. 
But then Act 3 has some issues? This might be the issues they're talking about. It just works. I trust you will follow your heart wherever it will. leads. I fought to right the wrongs of the coast. To slay the men and monsters that hunt the helpless. It is in the wilds that I find my courage. Not in the halls of upper city estates. There will be no Grand Duke Will Ravenguard, and there will be no Blade of Frontiers. So... I am now the Blade of Avernus. For as long as demons and devils imperil the Sword Coast, they will be my prey. Then go with my blessing. Be Faerun's great defender. Okay, so Courage, I did that. insight, strategy, justice. That was freaking weird. Let these be the lights that guide you, my son. Hail! The Blade of Avernus. The Blade of Avernus. She's in. A calm settles over you. The Elder Brain is a menace, but with the Blade of Avernus at your side, you know you can triumph. So we, we did that story arc twice. Twice now. It's just like, oh, Blade of Avernus. That's what he wants to do. Hey. Wait, what freaking camp is this? We got like that... Th th there's no gnome on that windmill. Okay, so... I do believe... This whole thing with the dragon... Wasn't about getting allies. That was Will's companion quest. Now we just have to deal with our fiery friend and the Gathanki warrior, which I do believe is ill-fated because I really don't see myself doing this whole thing with the Orthic Hammer, even though I am strongly considering going to get the hammer, but not actually freeing Aphelius. I, I would like to see a world where once the Elder Brain is taken care of, we could free Aphelius, which I would imagine the Emperor can just do anyway, and then he can go on to help out the Gathankis. But that's neither here nor there. That's beyond, beyond, the, beyond the scope of this video. That was Will. Will Ravenguard's companion quest. Slipped in me. Sli what? Okay, it's late. I need to go to bed. Like, subscribe, come back for more. Find me on Kick. I almost said Twitch. Yeah, it's late.